Hello, I'm Dr. Christina Olszewski and today we'll be going over your checklist of what to do before and after your scheduled iris biopsy. The type of iris biopsy you'll be having is an FIT. This is short for the finger iridectomy technique. An FIT is a minimally invasive but very effective biopsy method developed by Dr. Finger which allows him to obtain pieces of tissue and cells large enough for pathological evaluation. However, the FIT only requires a very small incision. Prior to your scheduled procedure, you'll want to pick up the medications we sent to your pharmacy. It's important that you do so because you'll need to start taking some medications the day before your scheduled biopsy. Unless otherwise advised, the medications you'll be picking up are Combigan, a drop to control eye pressure, Neptizane, an oral medication which also helps to control eye pressure, Tobradex, a combination antibiotic steroid drop, and Cyclogel, a dilating drop. All of these medications will aid in proper healing of the eye. Let us know if you are allergic to any of these medications prior to taking them. The day before your surgery, you'll need to take one drop of Combigan in the operative eye in the morning and evening. The day of your surgery, you'll take the Combigan the morning of your procedure. You'll then come to the hospital at the time stated by the surgical coordinator. That's usually two hours prior to your scheduled surgery. Once you're back home after the surgery, that evening you'll be taking one drop of Combigan, one drop of Cyclogel, and one drop of Tobradex in the operated eye. Make sure to shake the Tobradex well prior to installation to evenly disperse the steroid and antibiotic. You'll want to wait at least five minutes in between drop installations. In addition to these drops, you'll also take one Neptizane tablet by mouth the evening of your surgery. The morning after your surgery, you'll take another Neptizane tablet by mouth and instill the same drops from the night before. Again, that will be one drop of Combigan, one drop of Cyclogel, and one drop of Tobradex. That day after surgery, you'll have to come back to the office for a follow-up exam to check your vision, eye pressure, and eye health. At this follow-up, we'll go over what medications you'll need to continue taking. If you have any other questions, please feel free to call us at the office. We'll see you soon.